Hi guys, it's Gina. Thanks for tuning in to my channel. Um, um, oh. Oh. <laughs> anyway, I had on some lipstick. It was pink. It was so pretty. Um, thanks to um, Tika. Genacious. Is that her name? But anyway, yeah, because I won. I won her giveaway, so I'm really excited about that. Um, so I'll put on the, the lipstick later, I guess. But anyway, so today I'm baking cookies. I'm baking cookies with Granny. I don't know how to bake. So she's teaching me how to bake. She bakes some easy cookies. I'm going to teach you how to do the easy ones. So, um, yeah, we're baking cookies. So, um, yeah, check it out. All right. Yeah, I'm recording you. Okay. So you said you could use walnuts also? You don't have to. You don't have to. Hmm. Chocolate chips? She said, she said, she said, she said the size of walnuts, did she? Yeah, that's what it said. Yeah, don't say you don't have to. <laughs> <laughs> but make the cookie a little what, bit. What you, the only thing you want to put in there is that spoonful of sugar. Oh, okay. And, and, and uh, cinnamon. Some cinnamon. And mix them together. Uh-huh. And then you're going to roll your little balls in it. Okay. Okay, let's see. Okay. So I got shortening, sugar, and two eggs. So mix this together. So basically, the cookie is the shiny. Not as it is. Yeah, but no recipe it is. It's supposed to look like that? Yeah. yeah. And then it says stir together, I guess in a different bowl, the flour, or the same bowl? What did she say? What did she say? It say stir together and stir in. Oh no! It say sift together. What that mean? Stir together what? It don't say stir. It say sift. That that egg that egg and nearly done. Is it? No. So you need to put flour in that now. Put flour in. There? What, what, what goes in that? That's just the, the eggs, the shortening, and the sugar. So I add the flour in here. Uh -uh. Okay, so. Ooh, this is hard. So. <laughs> two and three, two and three, four. It's really no water in it. Okay. Two. Okay, this is a whole two. It's dry. Okay, so. How much sugar do you? Well, I did the sugar already. So I'm not gonna do the flour. Oops. Don't waste too much. Okay. It don't take much to get a course. So, this is going to be my first time baking anything from scratch. So, I'm really excited about this. Okay, so two and I can't see. Oh, two and three fourths. Okay. So, now two and three fourths. Three fourths right here. Okay. Okay. Now, Don't want to put too much. Want to be perfect. Okay. And okay. And then we're gonna do the the baking soda and the salt. All right. Salt. 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 
That's it. The bacon powder and the salt. Like this. That's how it's supposed to look. Oops. Uh oh. I messed up already. It's not supposed to be this dry. Oh man. Yeah, to get right. Too much flour. No, we can't put too much flour. We can put too much flour. Oh, okay. Mix it up, mix it up. Yeah, should I go ahead and put the, the salt. powder and the salt in it? Yeah. But, so I have to go back and see how to substitute again, right? How much of the substitute. So if I'm supposed to be using, I'm not dumb when it comes to this. If I'm supposed to be using one teaspoon of salt. soda oh. then I'm supposed to substitute oh boy oh boy one fourth teaspoon versus oh boy. of soda one teaspoon oh my god how much is that Very okay. little. That's very little, so... And, 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 and it'd be easier to use the major spoons out of the drawer then. But I have to calculate. Because it said that I'm supposed to use one teaspoon soda, right? But since I'm not using soda and I'm using powder, I'm supposed to use... You're not supposed to substitute... Less powder. You're substituting already. Y'all, y'all already, uh -huh. already putting the soda in there instead of the baking powder. No, we don't have soda. I mean the baking powder instead of the soda. Right. So. So, so do you use, did you put the soft salt in there already? Mm mm. Put it in there. Okay. Well, you can get it. I have. Okay. Okay. This one. Okay. Be sure it's a teaspoon. Spoon, teaspoon, not a thing. Okay, yeah, this is teaspoon right here. Okay, so we're going to use one of these. That's an awful lot of salt. That's too much. I, I bet. Don't, don't put that in there. Oh, it says a half. And it said a half teaspoon salt. And this is that's, a half. See, a half. Well, that's what you put in there. <laughs> that's what it says. And then it says one soda. One, one. But we're gonna substitute. What, 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 do, you, what, what do you substitute? The powder. And how much? It says one. One, one, one. One tablespoon. I mean one teaspoon. Same thing as the salt. It says one. Oh, that's a half. So two of these. Same thing as in salt, doesn't it? Two. Oh, I hope I'm doing this right. If you're not in a moment, a cookie is much easier to mess up than a cake. Okay. Oh, that's it, huh? Just mix it up. Start start mixing it up. Mm -hmm. Okay. And how does she say mix it? She says She said just stir it. And then it said chill the dough. Yeah. Okay. And it said roll into balls after that. Well, set it in, set it in the refrigerator. For how long? You, you, you don't have to really put it in there at all, except that it, it, it keeps it from running out. Mm -hmm. flat. Mm -hmm. Oh, okay. So the okay. best thing to do 
is when you you make a dough knot, turn it loose knot, put it in the refrigerator, and then while while the oven is getting hot, uh -huh. you get, okay. as soon as the oven gets hot, you put it in. Oh, okay. By that time, you'd be already rolling in balls and everything. Oh, okay. Okay. Making sure I get that salt in real good and that baking soda in, cause I didn't. Ooh, I don't know if it's in that good. I want these cookies to turn out good, cause these are gonna be my first time. So I want me some good cookies. Mmm. <laughs> look what I did! I made me some cookies <laughs> for the first time. I'm excited. I Okay, yeah, I turned it on. I turned it on 350, but I'm gonna put it on four. All right, let's put this in. Roll it in the ball. Five. And so you don't, so you don't get tired of the same ones over and over. Yeah, cook something different every time, huh? I like that. I always wanted to learn how to bake. That oatmeal box usually have a real, really good cookie. Oh, yeah. Recipe for, okay. For that, for that oatmeal. Uh huh. A oatmeal if cookie. You like yeah. oatmeal cookies. I do like oatmeal cookies. Okay, so I'm going to have to check that out. Maybe we can make that next week, huh? And put that cinnamon and sugar in it. My husband always said I, I bake better than I cook. Oh. <laughs> But I can't see nothing wrong with my cooking either. Yeah, I'm sure you cook good too. But um, you just make some but sweets. He had admitted it was for the dessert. It was, it was, it was, it was, it was good. Because cake is, and especially cake, a cake, I mean, instead of that, using that powder box. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. And you find out that it, Actually, the flavor tastes a little different with that box than yeah. it does if you, if you do it like that. Yeah. Okay, you guys, I just took the cookies out the oven. This is the second batch. They look retarded, don't they? <laughs> but um, these are the sneaker doodle cookies that I made. And I tasted the cookies, and the cookies are delicious. So I'm really excited. I made my first batch of cookies, homemade cookies. Woohoo! All right. Thank you guys for watching, and peace.